Hello friends, it's me yet again. So, um, today I wanted to show you uh, basically a very strong magnet. And something called the block wall. Which, uh, you know, that's what some people call it. Basically, it's just <clears throat> it's just um, kind of like a a line, like a strong um, energy uh, plane that exists between the two poles of a magnet. And uh, to show you this, um, I have some magnet um, paper here, and. As you can see, <clears throat> there's a um, yeah, there's a very defined uh, line, which uh, which you can see, and if I if I turn the magnet around on its um, end. Uh, you can see like a circle uh, being created and uh, if I had a much more sensitive um, type of magnet paper uh, which I'm sure doesn't exist right now although um, YouTube user uh, Sir Zerp um, <coughs> showed it pretty well with his um, LED uh, type setup where he actually was able to photograph um, the standing wave pattern which looks kind of like a, um, a lotus pattern and others have said that if you if you place a magnet up to like um, some kind of a screen like a C, CRT scanner screen or something like that you can see the field also extend on the screen and uh, if you rotate the magnet the lotus pattern stays still and again uh, some have called that uh, fixed field theory where the field is locked in space and operates independent of the rotating magnet or the atoms of the uh, iron and uh, yeah, so let me show you that one more time. Walter uh, Russell, his work also talks quite a bit about um, the mechanics behind a magnetic field, including the block wall. And uh, various um, time related uh, things uh, <laughs> and um, yeah so I just wanted to show you this before I show you my animation because uh, our galaxy is just a much larger um, magnetic field it's the exact same pattern uh, just at a different scale and this pattern is systemic to all reality just at different scales it's different um, intensities or different uh, you know sizes of the same pattern like a fractal or um, a hologram even where the whole is contained in every um, part no matter how small you go although um, there is something else other than the pattern, it's uh, called the ether field, which uh, is the smallest you can go. It's beyond, um, it's smaller than any uh, particle. And uh, yeah, so thank you for watching, and now I will show you my latest uh, computer animation. Thanks.